we've just left the launch. We're lost already. We don't know how to get to Dover. Uh, there are about there are about 400 cars that are going there, and somehow we've managed to get lost. Well, it's only finding Dover, Denmark. <laughs> So we're in Belgium right now. Uh, Will got us lost for the second time. So we're here on the uh, hard shoulder of the motorway. Met a bunch of guys that obviously had some problems, so I'm gonna go find out what's going on. Uh, the checkout party. Uh, we're all camped up now. Hello. What are we What's your team name? The Motor Monks. Motor Monks. Well, good luck. Yeah. And when I say good luck, I mean break down lots. Hopefully we'll make it, so... Shit! Stop! We wanted to camp out in the middle of nowhere. We went to a restaurant, asked where we could sleep, and they showed us this cave, and they said we could stay here for free, which is awesome. was to go through Turkey here and cross the Black Sea to Russia. And where are we now, Will? We're now on the Turkey-Georgian border. And what are we going to do after that? Go through the Georgian-Russian border. But there was no ferry across the Black Sea, so we've had to come this way. It's our only option, but it's an extra stamp in the passport, which is good. Your bedroom. What are you doing? <laughs> like, why are you sleeping? <laughs> Georgia to Russia. The border crossing is taking forever. We've been here for three hours already. We've moved two meters. It's about 8am and 
desert in the north of Russia. No, South Russia. And there are a shitload of cows. We've been pulled over by the police for the second time today in Russia. We are in Kazakhstan, we're going to raise our suspension and get some guards done. Perfect. In the middle of Kazakhstan. Come back! Which way is Mongolia? I think we need to follow it. Later. Little progress. Thanks a lot, Carlos. We've got a tractor involved and a friendly farmer. Yes! And Carlos's problems are resolved. Just woke up in this beautiful lake in Kyrgyzstan. As you can see, I've just been sleeping here on the floor. <laughs> Good morning. I think on the left there's guaranteed death, and on the right, I think on a ridge. Um, <laughs> what's the situation? We got a flat tire because I did a handbrake around that corner. We've been rescued. We're in the most amazing place, and we've been greeted by the most amazing people. We've eaten a meal, we've drunk vodka and beer. The mountains are behind us, the flowers are out, and it's just the best day of the rally so far.
Have we been given this? <laughs> milk. It doesn't taste uh, anything like milk. <laughs> that is not milk. It tastes like cream. Josh has been pulled over and he doesn't have his driving license. A bit worrying, isn't it? I'm asking for money, money, money. But we're not going to get money. So we just played the waiting game and we won again. Our one of a 24 hour road trip. It is now one o'clock, our 24 hour drive. And we just had the biggest flat tire we've ever had, so we just had our second puncture about an hour. It's currently 4.37 in the morning. We're somewhere in Kazakhstan trying to get to Russia. Our car smells of egg. Our battery is dying. It is dying. We now have no power. I don't know how that happened. We've been waiting for four hours so far, but I think we're pretty good to go. None of us know what to do. <laughs> Our roof box broke yesterday. So these are my mechanical seals. I mounted up two tyres and now Carlos has been driving like a nutter and the front tyre has moved massively far forward and the back tyre has sunk into the roof. It's made a huge dent. Team Wizard have uh, messed up their fuel pump and there appears to be a rock in there. Whatever it is, I don't know anything about mechanics. So we're going to be towing them about 55 kilometers now. Since our battery's dead, another team is pushing us. Go on. Yes! <laughs> Too much vodka. Sad day. I built my roof box at home. It took many weeks. And the roof box has done well, but it's it's broken the car. It was built too good. So I'm afraid tonight's gonna be a big fire. Get rid of the mozzies. Florian's got the honors of smashing it to pieces. I'm here because we're in the middle of the desert and 20 litres of petrol has just gone down the drain thanks to our intelligent friend Flo deciding that he wants to throw it on the fire and setting the whole thing on fire as a result. That's our new method of starting the car. I'm here because Carlos, the crazy Spaniards driver, has officially 
killed Cleopatra. That's not for most, yeah. is it? Jump start! Yeah. Our shock absorbers have just gone. Lateral stability. Can you drive? We follow? Cool, man. Okay, cool. Thank you. Mechanic? This is it. Yeah. Yeah? Apparently that's a car garage. Today we're going to Lambata. We hope. <laughs> gas, gas! Yeah, go straight, 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 straight. No, 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 no. Straight. Stop, stop. stop. <laughs> There's water in our car. <laughs> no! I can't take my foot off the revs because the exhaust is underwater. Yeah, let's go. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Yes, got someone to come in there. Close out the water. meters away from the place now. A guy pretending he crashed into us and now we've been arrested. Now we've been arrested on this police car car. I think it's in the Tingiscan Hotel. <laughs> 